Hi friends, in this session we will going to see the how to do the CRD analysis. Okay, uh, already in previous section, uh, already we have seen about the how to do the CRD analysis when our replications are unequal, right? And today's session we will going to see the our replications are equal numbers. Okay, let's see the for example. Okay, you can consider this as well. Uh, for example, you have the data R1, R2, R3 data uh, corresponding to the your treatments T1 up to T10, right? So, you can see here R1, R2, R3 are equal numbers, right? For the all treatments. In previous session, already we have seen about what happened if we consider the treatment 1 having 3 replication, treatment 2 having 5 replication, treatment 3 having 6 replication. Likewise, already we have seen and uh, that session also uh, I explained about the how to do that data analysis in Excel as well as the in OPSTAT. Right. So, uh, to this session um, we will consider our design as well. I will explain this design as well and then afterwards uh, we will go to the OP stat and we will do the same analysis and we will going to compare our uh, excel software uh, with the OP stat right and this type of excel uh, softwares are available uh, for selling if you need then definitely go to the description box of this video and uh, you will get my whatsapp number over there and just contact me so i will give you pricing okay because uh, all services we provided it's um, paid services so that you need to pay uh, to take uh, services from us so uh, definitely reach out with uh, my whatsapp number and then, then definitely i will give you pricing for this okay and we do the uh, different types of data analysis as well for the students then definitely contact us okay uh, let's um, uh, explain this okay you can consider your uh, character name as a plant height for example and this design is for the CRD analysis for the equal number of uh, replications okay you will get the ANOVA table then CDCV 5% 1% okay and final thesis table also you will get the significant for 1 and 5% and additionally you will get the bar graph ok so that you need to only put here the character name or uh, axis title vertical and horizontal only everything is um, fully automatic so you need to only uh, change these red color values or if you want to copy paste you just go your values right click copy come to the design and just click and you can see here the you need to only paste here the values okay just paste values and rest of the thing a uh, design will do okay if you want to modify anything for example uh, you can see here the your cv value is 28.98 you you need to minimize it right so you can find out uh, for example i'll do this 400 to 200 right you can see the changes yeah you will get the cv value is very low right 23 point these type of things you will do only in excel okay it's not possible in any online software or in op stat or any other online software it's not possible this is only possible in excel sheet if you need this excel sheet then definitely contact us we will sell this type of excel sheet okay uh, let me correct it okay so this is fully automatic so you don't need to do anything just you need to copy paste your data or just give the input of your data uh, in uh, replacing with this red color values okay so uh, let's open op stat and now we are doing this the crd analysis okay for equal number of replication right in previous session already we have seen about the unequal number of replication and this session we are considering the equal number of replications okay uh, you can see here the option one factor analysis just click on it okay you can see here the uh, data enter box you should have to enter the uh, your data over here and you will get the format of your data over here okay so let's copy our data you can copy from this table or you can copy from this as well okay just copy it 
then you can paste over here okay and uh, once you count we have the three replications and ten treatments okay so submit it and this is the uh, this is pop up came because uh, uh, they launched a new site okay so already i explained in my previous section um, uh, if you want to watch that video you can go there and watch that video as well okay so uh, you need to specify your uh, treatment numbers so that how many treatments 10 treatments okay then specify your replications we consider three replications and specific number of sets how many set we consider just one okay so uh, you can see here uh, you have two options for the selection of your design right because in rbd also we consider the equal number of replications because uh, it's a randomized block design right and uh, in crd we don't consider the uh, replications but we take as a replications right so that you can see here two options first is a rbd second is crd already rbd videos on our uh, channel so that uh, if you need then you definitely go there and watch that video as well uh, in this session you consider crd only okay if you want uh, transformation of your data then definitely you can uh, choose here uh, square root transformation or angular transformation okay many times it's required when your data in uh, small numbers or when your data having zero and likewise values then we need to transform your data right so if need that then definitely you choose this otherwise uh, you just select no transformation okay just click analyze okay you can see here you will get the analysis of variance table uh, let's compare with our um, analysis of variance table in our design okay let's see 9 20 29 you can see 9 20 29 and the sum of square 65147 65147 yeah it's correct almost uh, in op stat you can see here the significance you will get the significance it means you will get just a p value over there right if you want p value we will add that p value as well because we developing this type of sheet so no problem so you can see here these treatments are non significant right and in op stat also it showing these are non significant how uh, this is p value so that you need to compare this p value with the 0.01 or 0.05 so you will get the answer that right so below that uh, you will get uh, final mean table in that you will get the mean for uh, 10 treatments then standard error you can see in our design we don't have that standard error but if you want then definitely we will add here standard error values okay it's simple one to add ten standard error values for each treatment okay you will get that as well so you can see here you will get the cd value only for 5% and if your treatments are non significant then you will get here the na values right but in our design you will get the values if you need or if you want to put that values in then definitely you can put otherwise uh, just keep Uh, as uh, non-significant only, right? In OP stat, you can see here you will get the mean, then standard error difference thirty nine fifty six. You can see here thirty nine fifty six. It's correct. Okay, so you will get the CV value as twenty eight point nine eight. It's also equal twenty eight point nine eight. Okay. In Excel, um, there is uh, more advantages as compared to the online analysis. Okay, you can see here if you want to change any value. For example, uh, if you have CV value, then you need to modify it. Then definitely you will going to modify from this Excel sheet. Otherwise, it's impossible to modify in online software, in R or SPSS software. It's very difficult to modify it. So. Uh, in excel you will get the extra thing also you will get the graph as well right you just need to put the axis title for example uh, in this axis you can put the treatment just click on it double click 
or just select the text and uh, give the name like treatments okay so this type you can modify or just right click copy paste wherever you want in word or excel you can do that from excel right and uh, if you want um, final thesis table you will get that final thesis table as well in excel okay uh, i think so in this session you learn about the how to do the equal number of applications for the crd data analysis okay and everything you will get um, in our uh, excel sheet as well uh, which uh, op that you uh, give you okay in extra advanced you will get in excel sheet okay as compared to the op stat or any other statistical software right so i think so you learn about this then if you have any query or if you want to buy or if you want data analysis from us then definitely contact us uh, uh, my number uh, i put in the description box of this video then definitely contact me okay but uh, keep in mind uh, i provide all services or paid services so um, consider that okay uh, i think so this session i think so i completed everything regarding the crd data analysis okay if you have any query regarding this then definitely ask me in the comment box i will definitely answer your query okay thank you so much